Hello everybody, welcome back to another AI video. In this one, I am in Bing Image Creator. This is the image creator that's powered by Dolly. It is currently unlimited, it's free, and it is fantastic. I'm gonna show you how to create vector icons, not just regular icons, vector icons, and all of this with an unlimited number for free. Sounds crazy, but it's true. Let's go through this step by step. First step, you'll notice here that I'm in Microsoft Edge, and this is on purpose, believe it or not. Uh, it's come a long way, and it has a few things that the other browsers don't have when it comes to using Microsoft's Bing Image Creator. So I'm on Bing.com. The first step, click on Images, like I've done here, and you'll get a whole bunch of stuff. Okay, I see you, Chris Hansen. Yeah, yeah, you're not going to get me, pal. Um, and then on the right side here, you're going to click on Image Creator. When you do that, you're gonna get into the Dolly image creator, or the Bing image creator, perfect. The next step is you wanna create icons. Now, whatever kind of icon you're looking to make, I'm gonna go ahead and make one real quick. Bulldog icon, bulldog vector icon, style studio, I don't know, let's go studio Ghibli, uh, and then just hit enter. Doesn't matter what it is. While it loads this up here, you're gonna notice up at the top right here on the search bar, it says 96. Basically, you get 100, fast creations per day. So here we go, this made a pretty cool looking icon. You get 100 of them. When that runs out, you can still use it unlimited. It just goes a little slower. So this is an currently unlimited number of icons or anything that you want to create. I kind of like this, I gotta, let's go with this bulldog, I like him. I'm gonna click on him and then I'm just gonna right click. I'm gonna save that image and I'm gonna save it to my desktop. And again, there are multiple ways to do this. So I'm just gonna call this one bully icon. So there we go. So there we go. We've got our we've got our image. Off we go. You can also just click on download if you want to as well. Whatever. Okay. The next step to create it is you want to go to this website here, vectorizer.ai. This website is also free. You don't even have to create an account or log in. You can literally just drag and drop your image, your vector, or whatever the heck you're trying to make, the vector you're trying to make, pardon me, and go nuts. So I'm going to go into my Finder. If you're on a PC, that'll be your Explorer, Windows Explorer, and then just grab that image we made here. So this is bullyicon.jpeg. I'm just going to drag and drop it on there, and it's going to do three things. It's going to upload it, it's going to process it, and then it's going to fetch it, even though this is a dog. How perfect is that, hey? Beautiful. Original on the left, vectorized result on the right. I am just going to click on Download, and then you can go ahead and play with these settings. But again, I'm not going to touch any of it. I'm going to make sure that SVG is selected. That means scalable vector graphic. Left click on that download and presto, it is downloaded. You can see here in my op in my downloads file, it is .svg. Open the file. I'm going to go ahead and take a look at it. So let's go ahead and, uh, oh, I guess I got to give them permission. And there it is, bullyicon.svg. I'll put it on my desktop for, for giggles. And there it is, guys. If I double click on it, it'll probably load Adobe Illustrator. There we go. You can create hundreds, thousands of free vector icons. And just to confirm that it's vector, look, there's all the paths and layers all laid out for you. It's beautiful. This is the way, guys. Thanks for watching.